Hello, my beast Toycat, and this is episode 88 of my Minecraft Rex 60 update adventures. And in this episode, I'm going to be transporting the last three stacks of stone from my base thing uh, over to the other side of the world. And I'm also going to be uh, putting down some cobblestone, laying the path, uh, and you know, doing two things at once, I guess. And also, I'm going to put some cobblestone in the furnace, I guess, so we'll take a couple stacks out for that. Um, since, as I said, just ran out of my last uh, stacks of you know, um, stone, which is a really big, sad moment for me. But I've got plenty of coal to heat up some more, so let's let's do some of that. Uh, and some raw fish, or I guess it's cooked fish now, uh, just in case I run out of food, because I, I, know, I know I like fish, because that's just the nature of being a toy cat. <laughs> well, I guess being a toy would mean you don't have to eat, but whatever. Um, <laughs> for the record, uh, I, I want to clear this one up now. Uh, some people are like, oh, it's a toy cat. How'd you come out with your name, RBX Toy Cat? Also, that was super loud. I'm going to turn that down. Um, and basically, um, I it's it's a long story that I don't. It's not very entertaining, and I figure it's better it remain a mystery than to tell you and you'd be like, oh. <laughs> so that's my uh, that's my official uh, line of thinking there. Uh, I also I need to keep that there. So I I know I'm being incredibly stupid in doing this. Also, I think my I only have boots anyway. Actually, I thought I had a helmet. I'm pretty no, I, I probably didn't have a helmet. Although having just boots on is pretty cool, so I guess I can deal with that. Um, but basically, yeah, I have a new pickaxe as well. I don't remember if I made that last episode, but I have one now, so that's all that counts. Uh, also, I'm using regular stone there by accident, but whatever. Uh, and we'll also make the we'll make a little bit of a wall here just to get started. And uh, yeah, that's that's really nice. But today I have something somewhat serious, so that's not really it is sort of serious, but it's it's serious in the least serious way uh, that I want to talk about. And it's basically gamification, which is something I, I did a little mini rant on. Well, it wasn't really a rant, rant. It was like, oh my god, if I if I was if I was born like, I don't know, let's say 20 years later when gamification is hopefully a thing, um, then, I don't know, I'd be so awesome at life, like, <laughs> I think most people would. I think that's definitely going to be a big step forward, so, um, rather than just, I want to quickly explain this, because I actually learned about this, like, I, I, I understood the basic concept, but I didn't know it was actually something that, you know, is actually act actively trying to be happened, a ha being trying to be happened, trying to be done by like real people and stuff uh, that I learned from extra credits. Which, by the way, awesome, awesome little show thing that I watch every now and then. Oh dear God, everything is on fire these days. Um, and I'm trying to work out my ways to the other side of the world. If you're wondering, because I sort of go this way, then I'm like, wait, this isn't right. Actually, wait, if you just go here, is this the part of the world where I built the staircase? I'm gonna quickly check, but um, yeah, so let's pull out the map and uh, get back to what I was saying. But yeah, gamification is like, I don't have a map. <laughs> that sucks. Wait, really? Yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, gamification is basically adding game like elements into real life. So, uh, an example would be if. Um, let me think of a good example rather than just uh, come up with a really bad one at first. But like I had no. So um, say when you uh, say there's a step counter because um, those do actually exist in there, like but not in a gamified form. And it looks like that's how do I connect that to up here? I guess I can have another staircase from. Can I make that jump? I I think I can make it, but with a lot of damage. So if we if we just prepare for that the good old fashioned way. But yeah. Um, so you have, there's a step counter that every time you get a step or some awful getting distracted. Um, but every, like, okay, let's say every, I don't know, 100 steps you level up or like it works in the same way as a game in that like, you know, your first 100 steps gets you to level 2, your next 200 gets you level 3 and so on and then you get some form of reward on those levels. That That's like gamification. Um, and it's it's a really cool little thing. And also, what, why do they make such big fire things that confuse me when they die? But whatever, um... Yeah, I think that's the big, uh, the big thing that's going to be happening at some point. Like, because uh, I don't know, gamification is it's it's something that can motivate most people. Because uh, I don't know, just the the basic concept of like leveling and stuff. That's that's something quite a lot of people actually like. Um, myself included. Like, uh, I was I was thinking to myself, so I can convince myself to. You know, uh, like like the example I used on Twitter was uh, I I'm actually uh, I used to be a RuneScape player. That's actually where the name comes from. But I'm not going to go any more in depth than that because I like leaving some things a mystery. Um, and basically, um, that's actually yeah, that was the first place. I, no, it wasn't first place. That was a whole other story. But yeah, basically, I I have a couple of 99 skills, which if you've ever played RuneScape, you know the depressing amount of uh, time that means I put into the game. And it's like I can click. It's literally clicking buttons. It's not like you're you know doing complex combat. It was me clicking a knife and then clicking a um, 
I wish we'd call it. Also, that was incredibly. Oh, that makes sense, I guess. Uh, and so we're gonna trap you, and you're gonna die, and then you're gonna. Okay, okay that's. Let's just buy the back him. Okay, or not, or maybe that will just happen. Um, just let let me kill you, please. Uh, whatever. I can I can deal with that for now. Um, but yeah, I can I can click a button over and over again to get to 99 Bletching and RuneScape, but I can't you know convince myself to learn about I don't know. I, I, whatever I was doing at the moment, I think it was like revising for an exam or something, because I was like super demurred because I'd just done it for like 20 hours in a row. And I was just thinking to myself, that's really interesting. If I, if, because I'm, I'm like super nerd, like, like there's, there's a game, like there's quite, I have quite a few apps on my phone that do something like that. Like, um, they take your GPS, like the one I'm using, or well, the one I've been, I used to use. Uh, it takes my GPS location, or my coordinates on Google and stuff, or not on Google, or Google Maps, sorry. Um, and it basically loads the map of the local area. And then decides, you know what? We're gonna uh, we, we we play. They then place ghosts around it, like um, like they they ch genuinely place ghosts around it. That you have to go to those areas, which involves walking, which is obviously healthy in some way. Um, and then you zap the ghosts, and when you do, you get XP, which can be used to level yourself up and stuff. And that's one of my favorite apps. Like that is such an awesome idea. Like in the future, that stuff will just be commonplace. Like I don't know. I I like the idea of the future. It'll be awesome. Um, and yeah, I, I just really look forward to that sort of stuff, and I, I want to talk about it because uh, I was just thinking to myself, gamification, Shoko, I want it, and yeah. Um, so besides that, let's let's talk about RuneScape. Cause, oh, I could I could just build right through this wall thing. Uh, so let's see if we actually can do that. I have a feeling there'll be lava if I do this for too long, so I'm going to be super cautious and go into sneak mode. Uh, is it is it crouch mode or sneak mode? Because you are crouching, but I guess what am I trapped on? Oh, <laughs> I guess that makes sense. Um, but yeah, you are sneaking, but you're oh, oh god damn, that scares me. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't know. Uh, just uh, another mi Minecraft musing. Hopefully, I got this exactly right. I could have got this awfully wrong, but there's a chance. And I don't know what the chance actually is, but there's a small chance I got it right, and we're gonna end up on the right. Yeah, okay. I was close. Within two blocks, that's not too bad. Uh, Yep, I'm definitely going to have to run backwards now because I really hate ghosts. And then we're going to just uh, head to the other side of the world and we'll work on the bank thing because that's that's going to take a lot of effort. But yeah, uh, I, I actually used to play a lot of RuneScape. Like, it's it's a really super fun game in my opinion. It's like, whee, except it's not. Like, uh, coming back to it now, I can't play it ever. But, like, it's it really is an example of how you don't need gameplay. You just need to convince people that leveling up is interesting. Um, I don't know, that's, that's just something that stuck with me forever, so... Uh, you know, leveling up equals better than gameplay. Like, like how Minecraft they had they had the leveling up, and now everyone's like, yeah, I'm gonna be complacent and happy and stuff. Um, I don't know. That that was the thing I was looking forward to the most. Like having XP in Minecraft, just an awesome idea. Maybe maybe I'm just prone to liking XP myself. Also, hello, Mr. Pigman. Uh, you appear to be hit by. Uh, <laughs> I love how they're just hitting him rather than me. That's that's incredible. I like that. Um, but yeah, we're on the other side of the world now. It's actually quite a short distance if you can manage it properly, which I'm gonna have to do. But that's that's a whole nother episode, or I could probably just do it off the video. I don't know how I'd do it. I don't. Oh wait, what? Did I really make that mistake? Wait. Wait, what? Do I understand? Yeah, I've got to go to the other side. This isn't the side I came out on, though. Well, you've it, this has lost me. This is this has definitely lost me. Okay, so this teleports me to. Okay, let's let's see where it teleports me. I'm pretty sure this is my house. Okay, that's okay. That's interesting. I'll take it, I guess. I have I got bad memory, or has that never been the way it's been? Okay, we'll we'll just run back to the other place. Um, th that's that's gonna be a glitch. That uh, I don't know what to think about that. I'm I'm confused though. I I feel I I don't even I don't even know. Um, or some cool like randomly jump and place blocks every now and then, and then jump on those blocks because that's cool and fun. Uh, so we have to dig through this mountain bit here. Uh, then we have to go across this little hole, and then we have to take a little turn left over here, which is. Obviously durable. Um, we have to go. This is where the blocks need to be, ideally. I think so. We'll just head this way a bit. Uh, dig through the mountain while we're here. Um, 
And this should be where the stone there is, unless I miscounted last time I was out. Uh, which is it's a perfectly plausible explanation. Um, but, okay, yeah, I was I was close, whatever. Um, so this is, like, so oh, oh, it's a bit slime. Uh, at least it's not um, a uh, blaze, because, ah, uh, blazes. What? No, wait, blazes. That's not gas. That's the one. They all have funny na names, like, oh, dear. Um, oh, really? <laughs> what? Look at that. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one person who's ever been slain by a magma cube. I'm I'm pretty sure that's true. Um, hopefully not. Oh wait, I I was on a ledge when that happened, so I think my stuff will go everywhere. Uh, but I'm gonna quickly check which side the world teleports me to. Um, this side, apparently. There has this always done this? Have I really just got awful memory? I. I don't know anymore. I, I really don't. I guess it must do. Eh, I'm confused. We'll we'll find out the old-fashioned way, I guess. Maybe maybe the world has flipped, or maybe I honestly just have awful memory. I, no, I ah uh, whatever. Let's let's let it go. But yeah, um, fun things and stuff, and my stuff is going to be everywhere. Yep, that's it's always a great time when your stuff's uh, rolling down a mountain. Also a bucket. Um. Seriously, ghasts. Now I'm I'm grieving over the loss of all my experience points. Although I only had like one level at the time. Uh, can you please just give it a rest for a minute? It's super annoying. I can make your whole race go extinct. So can we stop? Yes, thank you. Okay, so now let's uh, actually let's confirm what's down here. Um, it's quite nice how the ghast can't hit me, but well, he, well, he probably could if he tried hard enough, but. He's not, so that's all that counts. Uh, also, there's a zombie pigment on my house. That's it's always a lovely, lovely thing. Oh, a little hole here. Wee, oh. Wee, okay, so now we can put all my stuff back in the inventory. So, arrow, cobblestone, gunpowder. Uh, ghast here, I have no idea. I guess they're for brewing, but I have never used them ever. So, that I don't have any use for them. So, I guess I could uh, donate them to charity or something. Uh, I could just burn them in a fire and just be like, God damn it, stop giving me useless items, game. Um. What do you know? The the never is that way around. I always figured it was the other. Well, I didn't always figure. But, and for some reason, it get I, it flipped in my mind. Which doesn't make any sense, but it does now. Um, and yeah, let's let's head over to the bank of Toy Cat and Toy Cat's uh, infinite knowledge and wealth. Or well, is wealth knowledge? Because to be fair, I think knowledge is more important than wealth. Why well, is that's a good question? Uh, really deep one. I don't really want to answer because there's no right answer. But the thing is, knowledge can buy wealth, whereas uh, wealth can't buy knowledge. Wait, I guess wealth could buy better access. To, I guess that's how wealth and I guess wealth and knowledge are actually very similar. So uh, just remember, kiddies, uh, if you want to be rich, tr spending a lot of time in school is actually good. Maybe, I don't know. Um, <laughs> I never really agreed with the whole. Uh, well, I, gu I guess I do, but I guess I think like uh, people. If you're doing badly in, like, uh, this is going to sound really awful. But if you're doing badly in your equivalent of, well, I guess, not your equivalent, but, you know, in whatever school system you guys have, then surely it makes sense for them to be like, if you want, you can go uh, just work now. Uh, since isn't it a waste of money to try and educate someone who's not very educated? I'm not going to go any more than that, but yeah. Deep political views. Um, <laughs> although actually, this is something I just want to point out. Like, I I love YouTube because it's like uh, I, I I was watching videos about like explaining the like I, I, yeah it was a video explaining the first path post system, and I was like that's that's goddamn interesting. Um, I obviously knew what it was, but it was like it explained it in a really cool way, and it's like I I really like the educational side of YouTube. Um, another thing why the future is awesome, you'll be able to learn, and it will be awesome. Rather than like the way we have it now, where it's like you learn and it's like here, yeah, not not really too interested in that. But maybe maybe that's just me not liking things too much. Uh, or maybe I'm just I just like the future. Too much. Maybe the future will suck. Maybe maybe like someone nukes the someone at some point in the future, and it's like oh the future definitely will suck. Like Fallout. That's speaking of Fallout. Uh, GTA Five is I don't know why it's ready to fall out in the slightest. Uh, but GTA Five is a uh, uh, for the record, this I'm gonna quickly confirm this one. Uh, let's let, let's play something I do. Um, that's something I really enjoy, and it's something I'll probably do at all the points. And also, I'm considering replacing my first video of the day with just a let's play video, 
which they're not as popular, I guess, but... So I guess, I don't know, I, that's something I'm considering doing because it's, I don't know, it's, it's just, yeah, probably easier. So I think it maybe, maybe we'd see what would happen if I did that, but, I don't know, if, it, for the record, since I guess, like, I guess between like two or three times people watch these videos, then watch the, uh, Let's Plays, uh, this will sound strange, but can you explain why so I can better suit them to you because, uh, as I said, love uploading Let's Plays. I do it just because I I really like playing through games. It's uh, as I said, uh, why well, not as I said? I always I always say as I said, just because it makes me sound fancy. Well, it doesn't really make me sound fancy, but it makes me sound like yeah, I know what I'm talking about, sir, and you don't because I'm making a voice like this for absolutely no reason. Uh, I guess I guess it shows that I'm you know a, a British person or whatever. But whatever, I have no idea why that's even related. Um, also, I'm scared as to how far I'm going to go back with this. Uh, I guess I just have a secret, like, vault, well, not a secret, but, like, a... Well, we'll just go back, like, five more layers, and that should be enough. Uh, we'll see what it looks like from there, and, uh... Do I even have the... Yeah, I have, like, so many stone slabs. Um, I say that now, and then I'll run out and be like, Oh, I don't actually have that many stone slabs. Um, but the, th the thing is, I have... I have forgot where I was going for that, but I, I just really like playing games. It's... Like, uh, for some people, gaming is just, like, something they picked up because, uh, you know, with the latest generation of consoles, uh, gaming is actually a really social thing because you, you play with your friends online. Like, some people actually replace their social interaction and uh, interaction with just playing online, which is, it's worrying. It's it's worrying that that can happen, but, you know, it's, it's still pretty cool that it can happen. Like, uh, I don't know. Things can be cool and worrying. Just uh, pro tips with Toycat, uh... Or hashtag toy cat knowledge, as I like to say it. Um, so yeah, I I don't know where that point was going. I don't know where any point goes. It's just like I say words, and then they're on the internet sometimes and stuff. And uh, also for the record, this is something I, I want to really talk about. I'm working on an outro. Well, I'm work. I don't really do this stuff myself. But I'm I'm working on getting a really cool outro right now. And uh, basically, what do you guys think is better? Because I always thought commentary over the outro was cooler. Um, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go with both, but I think I'm gonna go with both. But what's what's your opinion on outros? Do you prefer, like, uh, outros if you watch a lot of YouTube videos? If you only watch mine, one, that's awesome, and two, I guess it doesn't really apply. Um, and I'm just gonna do this because it looks cool, and for no other reason than I've run out of stone bricks anyway. Um, but yeah, if you, if you watch YouTube videos that have outro, what's your opinion? Do you prefer outros of commentary over them, or outros that are just like uh, some obnoxious dubstep music? Um, <laughs> I guess it doesn't have to be obnoxious dubstep music, but you know, outros of music. Because I think an outro of music can be done really well, that's why I'm combining the two. But uh, yeah, uh, I just spoke about outros, and also I really, really do like that. Look at it, it's like square, 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 and then... I, I think that would look pretty cool. I'm going to have to do something along those lines. Um, but yeah, this is the end of this episode of the Minecraft Xbox 360 saga. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, you can like it, let me know. Um, also, the bonus chest thing. I want to really prove that now. Um, the bonus chest has respawned. So yeah, if you like the video, like it. Uh, thanks for watching the video. There's a little cave here, and goodbye.